Hello, it's Salimic, and today we're gonna test if the water steam decarbonized engine or not. I will start with removing the cover so we can remove the coil wires and spark plugs. We're gonna need ratchet, extender, 16mm long socket. After removing the spark plugs, now we can see how much carbon we have on top of the pistons with using 7mm endoscope camera. By looking at the spark plugs we have good amount of carbon and the white tip indicates that we have a clean fuel injectors otherwise they would be black. And the oil on the rest of the spark plugs the cover gasket need to be replaced. Let's see how much carbon we have. Entering cylinder number 1. No carbon build up but there is some rust spots. Looks like the fuel contains water or it's air moisture. Cylinder number 2, we have carbon buildup in the center of the piston and some rust spots. Cylinder number 3, just like cylinder number 1, only rust spots. Cylinder number 4, carbon buildup and some rust spots. Now we're gonna put the spark plugs back and do our experiment to see if the water steam cleans carbon buildup or not and compare before and after videos side by side. We're gonna enter the water steam from the vacuum line which is connected to PCV valve after the throttle. Steam enters the intake manifold and then combustion chamber from the intake valves. Next we're gonna start the engine and let it reach idling temperature before doing anything. The engine must be at 2000 rpm, let somebody assist you to hold the gas at 2000. If you're working alone like me, you can adjust it from the throttle cable if it's not electrical. And now we are ready to steam the engine. After steaming 100mm of water, we're gonna put the PCV hose back and adjust the throttle cable back to normal. Moment of truth, we're gonna take the spark plugs out and see if it removes the rust and the carbon buildup. I don't see any changes on the spark plugs, pretty much they look the same. Entering the cylinder number 1, looks like it cleaned the rust spots. Cylinder number 2, the carbon still there but the rust spots being removed. Cylinder number 3, just like cylinder number 1, no rust spots. Cylinder number 4, here we can clearly see that the rust spots gone, but the carbon still there. For cleaning carbon buildup, I used a video where I sprayed carb cleaner from the same vacuum hose and had good result with it and also it cleaned the intake valves. I will put the video in description box below and YouTube card if you are interested to watch.
After doing steam cleaning method, I recommend engine oil change. So in conclusion, it may work for light carbon buildup, but not for heavy carbon buildup. Carb cleaning method works better. As always, thanks for tuning in. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.